right? Someone uh, sent me a video the other days with a bunch of you know Chinese uh, teenagers. They're they're kind of taking a, a idiotic class about patriotism, and you know where that where that video was hosted, right? Someone uploaded the video onto Pornhub, right? And, and the title of the video was really appropriate. It was like teens mind fucked by the Big Brother. <laughs> really, really an accurate title because that's exactly how I felt as a kid, right? But you know, you know, it's just you know, you can't imagine how many real porns I have to watch in order to drive those patriotism shits out of my head. <laughs> you, you might think you know it's just a Chinese thing, right? It's just some communist bullshit, right? But wait until you see a Trump rally. <laughs> oh my goodness! You know the the. You, you can feel the smell of patriotism just you know fills the air, or maybe it's just Budweiser, I don't know, or, or maybe just some you know smog from the cold counties, you know whatever it is, it just you know, spills over from from the TV screen, you know, just knocks me into a, a Chinese deja vu. You know, you know some people are really concerned with the, you know, the racism and that kind of shit. I'm not really concerned with that. You know, but do you think what scares me most about Trump? You know, when that guy walked past a national flag, he fucking hugged it. You know, you, you know, it's you know, trademark smile. <laughs> so what the fuck? What what kind of freak? What kind of pervert would be aroused by a flag? <laughs> be careful, flag. You may have to sign an NDA someday. Okay? <laughs> You know, just just picture that shit gets its way into the into the you know the, the, the flag hugging shit gets its way into the public education system, right? I mean, I mean, American teenagers are not perfect, right? Some that sometimes they have too much you know sex and drugs, but it's still better than sex and drugs and patriotism. That's just too much.